Our next top 10 recipient nominated by the Nevada chapter is Jimmy Floyd, Manager of Construction Management, Clark County, Nevada, Public Works. Yeah, thanks, Keith. Um, yeah, I mean, for the questions, I mean, pr professionally, I think one of, you know, the things I'm most proud about is, is the ability to have been able to move up in, in, in my career, um, it, you know, from working in the trenches as a 15-year-old um, all the way to now, you know, 28 years later, managing one of the largest construction divisions w w within Nevada. You know, it's, it's, it's quite the opportunity for, for somebody that thought they'd be on the back end of a back of his entire career to be in the position I am now. You know, that's, that's uh, really proud of that. Um, I'm also proud of the improvements we've been able to make for our community as far as uh, improving the customer service aspect and, you know, people coming to the counter and, and, um, uh, having those needs met uh, when they come ask a question about a project or if they're, you know, building a project. We've really made uh, some vast improvements as far as that's concerned, you know, uh, working in, in public work sometimes is like driving a tanker ship in a storm and, and, and turning that rudder sometimes can be fairly difficult. And, you know, over the past few years, I've really seen that the ship kind of turn and that, that that's been a, a vast improvement. Um, as far as, you know, us, you know, at, at Clark County, one of the things we're very passionate about is, is planning for the future. Um, you know, it's, we're managing all the construction and the maintenance of the Las Vegas Strip, one of the most busiest corridors in the entire country. And uh, right now we're in the middle of the multi-year, multi-phase project to really uh, provide the improvements we'll need for the next 30 or 50 years to address the concerns of the technology community, the, the transportation network. Um, and we're really planning for the future so we don't have to impact the community as, as often, you know, so hopefully we don't have to touch that area for the next 25, 30 years. <clears throat> we're also looking at systems to allow us to better track, monitor, and, and manage our, our traffic control systems within the right-of-way. Uh, with large, uh, you know, um, infrastructure such as like the Strip, you know, it's Everybody wants to get in there at the same time to get work done. And when you're doing a large capital project, you don't always have the opportunity to allow somebody to get in there for a day or two. And, and so we're working with technology partners uh, to bring us an opportunity to better, better track and, and allow those contractors or developers or even a business owner to get in there for a few days or a few weeks when it won't impact our projects. Uh, and then also that reduces the impact to the, the, the commuters in the area. You know, it's, you know, getting visitors and, workers uh, to the properties is critical for us and using technology to allow that to happen better is, is always um, is very important to us. Uh, lastly, with regard to APWA, it's, it's um, as an organization, it has impacted me uh, both professionally and personally. Um, in Nevada, we like to say that the Nevada APWA chapter is one big family. Um, you know, it's, um, we have, have a lot of relationships with, with other agencies, contractors, um, other engineers uh, that we kind of rely on is, is, as far as um, being able to discuss projects, uh, interlocal agreements, different technologies, different issues we're dealing with. And having that contact is, is critical for us to be successful as, as public works managers and, and directors. Um, I think that's really the, the big value for APWA. You know, I, I mean, I could talk about the training opportunities that they provide for our employees that are, are second to none in the industry and are easy and accessible. So uh, you can set those up quickly. Um, and that's just a critical improvement. Um, uh, there's a lot of organizations out there that we have an opportunity as professionals to join. And whenever somebody asks me, you know, if I'm mentoring another engineer or, you know, you know, somebody in college and they asked me what organizations I should join. I, the top of my list is always APWA. It, it's, 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 it's the, the, the best organization as far as I'm concerned, as far as um, being diverse, as far as the, uh, the different people you get to deal with and the, you know, whether it's a contractor or an owner or, you know, utility company. Um, and, and then, yeah, it's, it's, it's been critical to my success and I look forward to, you know, hopefully another 20 years in this industry. Um, so it's, it's, uh, I'm very humbled by the awards organization to be able to be selected. So thank you very much.
Thank you, Jimmy. It's a, it was a pleasure meeting you at the Nevada Spring Conference just a month ago and, uh, and to hear your story from equipment operator to manager of your division. Uh, thank you for what you do for your community.